Hi everybody, I'm Carol with Free Spirit Arts. We're playing with fiber. I made a video already about all the fleeces that I want to get processed or process myself or get them ready for winter. And I thought y'all might want to see what I'm doing. This is two llama fleeces from our llama. They don't have a lot of lanolin in them, but they're dirty. Llamas roll and lay, and we put them all non. We were, we were um, beginners. <laughs> we put the llama in a beautiful, clean stall with straw. Yeah, that's probably not what we should have done. But, so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to open this fiber up. This is some that I have worked with. It's not clean, but it's open. It's more lofty. It has the dust taken out of it. it. has the little stuff. This is called a picker. And this one is from 1975. They really haven't come. I mean, there's all kinds. There's a, a one that swings like a pendulum. There's bigger box ones. There's huge industrial ones. And basically, it's a series of specifically angled nails. And it says right here, and you put your fiber in here. Let's see if I can get this right. You go back and forth. Hold on, I'm gonna need to change the my hand. Just keep going back and forth. And this says out. So it's pushed it out this way. So that's one pass. Okay. It's basically bothering the fibers and separating them. And because these fleeces are so dirty, I wanted to do this because I really want to check for um, wire and nails or you know, animals get into some weird stuff. There's not a lot of animal stuff in these llama fleeces that they don't stink. Well, I guess that's relative to what, you know. It doesn't smell like downy air freshener. This is not useful fiber. It's all in a big ball, so throw that away. And if you saw my other video, you know I'm taking this to get processed like a mill would do. We have a local gal that has set up a system and I'm grateful for that. So I'm gonna take her in a couple places. Give myself something to play with this winter. I like processing it myself also. And see that's not stuck because it's already been through. See all the dirt? Pretty ingenious, really. Whoever, whoever thunk this up is pretty ingenious. And there's been there's other versions of a picker. This isn't the only kind. I think I think this one's called a box picker, but don't quote me. Dirty fleece. Those are just stickers. So that's what I'm doing, and I plan to get this fleece mostly done and ready for her 
I don't know if she has a picker. I'm not sure about that. I need to call her. This might not be the fleece I take if she doesn't have a, any other way. But I just thought you guys might want to see. I could set up the tripod. Um, if it turns out that there's any interest, I'll do that. Um, because I've never done fiber on my channel, uh, like this, you know, animal fibers, I don't know how much interest there's actually going to be. So I may go ahead and cross post this to the Snake River Weavers and Spinners Guild. And if you're into, if you're just starting to learn how to process fiber, here you go. <laughs> I'm having fun. Okay, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.